Hi, I'm John with Inminder. In this 90 second video, you're going to learn nine steps for creating an effective third party risk management program. We recommend and have seen these steps carried out by our clients and across the industry. Step one, ensure everyone is on the same page by setting your organization's initial expectations on how third parties will be managed. Decide if your program framework will be centralized, decentralized, or hybrid. Step two, take the time to understand and define the lines of defense. Make sure each line knows their role. Step three, create concrete policy, program, and procedures documentation. These will serve as reference points for all lines of defense and how they should manage third parties. Step four, you need to have a strong contract management program that ensures your contracts are not going to hinder your ability to truly manage your vendors. Step five, implement due diligence practices like vendor vetting before you sign a contract. Step six, assess each of your vendors' level of risk to your organization. Step seven, maintain your due diligence after you sign the contract on an ongoing basis, depending on their level of risk to you. Step eight, don't just gather due diligence. Ensure to thoroughly analyze your vendor documentation to identify issues and risk. And finally, step nine, Ensure you have processes in place to report vendor issues at your organization and how you will work with your vendor to address them. Remember that done well, a third-party risk management program can help your organization better understand its risk and take steps to mitigate that risk. See you next time.